Hey guys, before I start today's video, I just want to take your two or three minutes. It's regarding meetup. Since you know that in last video, I've already declared that I'm going to be doing meetup in multiple cities. Now, um, what I thought is the best way to connect with you guys would be WhatsApp. This is the number what you see on the screen. Yes, please go ahead and WhatsApp your city. Just put a hashtag Bangalore, hashtag Pune, hashtag Mumbai, hashtag Trivandrum, hashtag Hyderabad, Delhi, Kolkata, or you know, the more number of people I have, I'm going to create a WhatsApp group and I'm going to put all those Pune people in one group, Mumbai people in one group, Hyderabad people in one group, so that just to have an understanding of how many people are going to show up. Just a kind of side note for you guys. If you're someone who is kind of introvert, so this morning I received a message someone saying that I'm not, uh, you know, comfortable with a lot of people around. It's completely fine. It's not a typical. I'm not there to pitch my idea to you guys. I'm there to meet you guys, talk to you, sit down with you one on one, and we can talk about it. All right. So don't be shy. Just come up and always make sure keep this in back of your mind that no question is a stupid question. Answers can be stupid. All right, so please come up and uh, try to get your friends also. And if you're someone who is in the engineering colleges or schools or anywhere, any of the institutions, if you're learning German language, try to get people along with you, no matter if they have uh, seen my channel or not. I'll be happy to meet them also. And, uh, you know, I will try to give as much time as I can to you guys. Let's start the day. What's up, beat makers? Welcome back to my channel once again. If you're new here, consider subscribing because I feel that my goal is to bring you the most delicious thinking and enhance your intellect to escape velocity. Let's start this day. So let me just start with the introduction of the video. What is this video about? Um, I'm in BVMW's event. Now, if you don't know BVMW, it is... Um, the German Association of SMEs. Right. So it is one of the... I think it's one of the most powerful association. Germany's uh, backbone is the mid-sized companies, small and medium-sized companies. The whole economy comes out from there. And this association has so many members. Around how many? Well, Mittelstands Alliance is like yeah. more than 530,000. Wow. So all these companies are part of this event. Um, now, a lot of people might be having this question like, um, in fact, some of the Indian friends of mine living here in Berlin and Germany, they, of course, always think like, how do you really reach to such event? How do you get invitations for all those things? Juliana is the person who actually takes me to such events. Um, why? Because she is part of BVMW. Now, it's not just that, it has a depth to it. Do you want to tell what connections do you have with BVMW? Yeah, I became a regular member actually as an entrepreneur, but uh, then I saw a chance because there was the young entrepreneurs being founded just in that moment when I joined the association. So I saw a huge chance to actually rejuvenate the whole association and uh, speak up for the uh, interests of young entrepreneurs because um, yeah they need more speed, they need more flexibility, more internationalization, digitalization. There are different um, requirements and, and challenges which young entrepreneurs meet and yeah that's why we found the young entrepreneurs because we need to have a voice for them and uh, right. yeah that's um, how I started the uh, yeah I became actually the, the, the vice president of young entrepreneurs and big uh, deal okay yeah mm -hmm. yeah <laughs> but I'm waiting for another one go ahead yeah keep talking okay. <laughs> yeah and also uh, I'm implementing a mentoring program so um, I'm char uh, in charge of that but uh, yeah after some time of course my network and my impact on the association um, got reinforced um, by another position which I am proudly holding right now because of my India related business <laughs> So, yeah. Um, yeah, now I am the director in Germany of all the India activities of the BBMW. Hell yeah. Yeah. I'm so proud of you. <laughs> Thank you very much. Just say in front of them. I mean, yeah. it's hard to appreciate people, uh, especially it comes from me. Uh, yeah, yeah, I know. It just takes so <laughs> much for me to appreciate someone. But seriously, uh, this is something which you guys should congratulate her for. Um, not because I'm asking you, but like, yeah, look at my progress, what I've done so far uh, with my vlogging, with my professional life. I've always, she's always been my side, whether it was thick and thin. Yeah, it is becoming more of a, like a thank you speech right now. But <laughs> yeah, in a nutshell, she is executive for Young Entrepreneurs Department of BVMW. 
Yes. And then she is director of businesses which are happening in, in India by this organization of BVMW in India, right? Yes. If that makes sense. Yes, and I have a counterpart in India itself. Uh, in Pune and uh, during the business trip yeah. also we're going to visit him so, and uh, he's organizing an event for us so that's really great. Right. Uh, one of the things which happening today this evening in the vlog is um, as usual if you guys remember last year I interviewed president of Estonia and there were other ministers. This is somewhat similar event. It's an annual event just like last year. Mm -hmm. uh, there'll be a um, lot of distinguished guests like political side and business side. I think this time President of Slovenia and uh, Defense Minister of Germany will be there in the event along with other dignitaries like um, there's a head for Turkish Airlines, there's a head for Digital Business of Telecom. Business yes. Deutsche Telekom, right? Yes, yes. Um, and some more powerful people. You know, I'm going to be taking you guys around and show you guys how big people live here. Yeah, I'm also and very How did they very socialize? Proud. I'm sorry for interrupting you. I, I couldn't hold it. But I'm very very proud that uh, um, the mentor of young entrepreneurs is going to be here and she's the, the current minister of economics and uh, oh, yeah. energy. So, yeah. um yeah, I, I saw really her look last up to her. Also. Yeah, yeah, she's a really good role model for strong women in a strong economy. That's her hashtag also in German. Um and yeah, she's just a very open mindset and supporting women in business especially. So I would love to interview her and ask her about India yeah. if she can some give some funding to startups. Yeah, we'll see. <laughs> we'll try. All right. Uh let me show you guys around now. So these are the guests actually on the list. This is the chairman of Turkish Airlines, he's going to give speech and then keynote by the president of uh, BVMW organization, BVMW. And then um, there is, as I already told you guys, the defense minister and Deutsche Telekom digital chief, economic minister of Germany. Christian Lindner is also the um, parliament minister here. The chief And also, there are so many distinguished members of the BVMW, also members here. Ladies and gentlemen, it's a great honor for me. I'm honored to be invited to speak here today in Berlin at the annual reception of BVMW, the German Association for Businesses that Make Up Germany's World Famous Mittelstand. The fact that the German language has a special word reserved for small and medium-sized businesses shows how highly they are regarded in Germany, and rightly so. Mittelstand is not only Germany's central driver of its export-driving economic growth and job creation, but also an integral and highly successful component of the global economy as well as Europe. Sehr verehrter Herr Staatspräsident Pahor, It is a great honor and privilege for me to address you here today, and I would like to thank President Mario O'Holland for this privilege. Dear friends, there is an atmosphere of mutual trust between Slovenia and Germany. We know each other well. We share the same values, a very similar business culture, and the development of a similar model of a social market economy. Slovenia and Germany listen to each other, look for common grounds, and have very similar views on the future of the coming year. Wurden und werden klaglos kompensiert. 
Auch deswegen unterstützt die Geschäftsführung diese Aktivitäten vorbehaltlos, eben weil sie in der Kooperation mit der Bundeswehr eine Win-Win-Situation sieht. Begrüßen Sie mit mir nun auf der Bühne Herrn Achim Rüttel. Ich habe Verständnis dafür, dass wir Bürokratie brauchen, aber ich bin genauso bei Ihnen, wenn Sie sagen, manchmal schießt Bürokratie eben auch über das Ziel hinaus. Deswegen ist mein Credo auch schon seit vielen Jahren, wir brauchen die Überprüfung der bürokratischen Anforderungen als Daueraufgabe. Ich kenne die neue Familienministerin, das war die Bezirksbürgermeisterin hier von Berlin-Neukölln, die Nachfolgerin des bekannten Heinz Buschkowski. Und sie hat in der Tradition von Buschkowski die Integrationsdefizite in ihrem Kiez nicht nur angesprochen, sondern bearbeitet und damit der deutschen Lebenslüge etwas entgegengesetzt. Multikulturalismus würde automatisch funktionieren. thing in the, these kind of events. I'm saying food is something which is very important part of such event yes. because you don't get to eat them every day like in a five star hotel. Well, I mean it was a, a quite a lengthy program, very interesting but now I'm really hungry. Yeah we just got wrapped with the event. I want to show you guys this is the same hotel this is the same hotel where I interviewed Mr. Walter Kohl and this is the same hotel where I interviewed President of Estonia I took some fish and uh, some steamed rice I'm gonna find Juliana, she's somewhere inside uh, This just gets too difficult man I have to see where is she So. I'm, I'm about to end the vlog. Any last words you want to put it out? Well, I'm very much excited to meet you guys. Hell yeah. Um, as I've already shown you guys that number at the beginning of this video, go ahead and use the hashtags Mumbai, Pune, Delhi, Hyderabad, Bangalore, Chennai, no matter which, which city you come from. So at the end of the day, it's not a hard uh, defined rule that I'm only going to be visiting I have two and a half weeks if I have enough number of people in different cities which are not mentioned yet I might make a plan for that all right for now as you guys saw today's video was more about um, you know business thing what we are involved in other than JNM education we have a JNM consulting company also here uh, where I would encourage you guys to go ahead and talk out to your bosses if you are a business owner if you're anybody who is involved into business and want to take your company international which is in Germany specifically uh, do not hesitate to write an email on this email ID so that the email actually goes to her and we can discuss it over Skype or the best way would be to come and visit us we will meet you separately for business purposes all right um, let's uh, makes things wonderful um, let's have a win-win situation um, she is head for BBMW here uh, for Indian Indian market so yeah man we have full support for you guys 
from here. Yeah. Alright. Looking forward to be in touch with you. Alright then. Bye bye for now. Peace out.